Hi there my friends and welcome to a new video of uh, Silver Dot International. Thank you all for watching and uh, the support. So I guess you are all aware of the Dutch Gulden and more specific the Wilhelmina Gulden of which I have the 1931 version uh, over here in my hands. The purity of this Wilhelmina Gulden is 72% and that makes the actual silver content in this coin about uh, 7.2 grams. The Wilhelmina Gulden contains less silver than the Juliana Rijksdaalder that I'm uh, taking out over here. And the Juliana Rijksdaalder has a silver content of uh, 10.8 grams of uh, silver in them. But in a circulated condition, uh, yeah, they would cost almost uh, exactly the same. And that's because of the numismatic worth. And so they would start around um, 7 euros, and that's about uh, something like uh, 8 US dollars. And so this uh, Wilhelmina series ran from 1922 until 1945, with uh, some interruptions uh, in between. And one of these major interruptions was, uh, yeah, of course, World War II, in which the Netherlands uh, came under German uh, occupation. However, uh, Dutch Guldens were uh, still minted during uh, World War II and I have one uh, actually and that is the one that I'm taking out right now. This is an, uh, one Gulden from uh, 1943 as you can see over here in my uh, hands. And uh, yeah, this uh, 1943 Gulden was minted in a quantity of uh, 20 million pieces. And it was intended uh, yeah, to use them uh, after the Netherlands uh, would be liberated. And the Dutch East Indies and Sur the Suriname colonies were also uh, intended to receive uh, yeah, portions of the 20 million uh, quantity uh, minted yeah, to put in use uh, after the war. And US coin collectors may um, recognize or see something uh, familiar uh, on this coin, actually. And I'm not sure if the camera is going to pick it up. Now, sadly, it's not going to pick it up, but I'll um, make a photo of it. On the left over here, you see a uh, palm tree. And over here on the right, you maybe can make out a uh, D. And uh, yeah, you got it right, people. This Gulden, uh, this Dutch Gulden, was actually minted in uh, yeah Denver, uh, United States of uh, America. So uh, in the Wilhelmina Gulden series, there are some uh, low minted years, but the years of 1943, uh, 1944, 1945 uh, are somewhat special. And uh, yeah, that's because they're minted in the United States uh, during the war, which is uh, yeah quite an uh, interesting uh, fact. I picked this one up for uh, 5 euros, which is uh, yeah quite uh, cheap considering the fact that uh, these circulated start at around uh, 7 euros and uh, going up. And I think this could be even uh, worth uh, double the money, maybe uh, 10 euros. The plan is also to add the 1944 and 1945 uh, guldens to my uh, collection. And when I have them, uh, I'll of course uh, post a video of them. I uh, hope you gained some uh, new insights and uh, like this uh, 1943 uh, Denver uh, <laughs> one gulden. If you would mind subscribing and liking uh, this video, it would make me a uh, very happy man. I wish you all the best and see you all uh, the next time.